because it's been a frustrating couple of days. My weight has gone up and down, up and yes, my hair is getting more blonde. No, you are not seeing things. Really been struggling like at the 156 pound mark for some reason. But then I got up today at 153. And I was so happy, I almost jumped up and down on the damn scale. But, so we're moving in the right direction. That means 12 total pounds lost since I like started doing anything, which was on, I think the 3rd of August. I'm so excited. I just, you know, I'll, you'll see all this in my week four update, but I wanted to share. I hope you guys are having a great day. me up and recommended this thing called fathead dough so i guess you use like five ounces of almond flour and 11 ounces of mozzarella cheese and a teaspoon of baking powder and one egg well let's see what happens <laughs> if this works i'm gonna be very excited because any kind of dough consistency would be fine by me So that delicious masterpiece you just saw was one made with fathead dough, but then I did another one with just straight Parmesan. And if you guys want to see a video on how to do that, I will do it. Just put it in the comments below. But basically it's just Parmesan cheese, a little bit of tomato sauce, and then turkey pepperoni on top. But as you can see, it picks up just like regular pizza and it was glorious. I don't even know which one's my favorite. And then this week I tried when I did my asparagus, I used MCT oil instead of olive oil and it was actually really, really good and super light. So something maybe just try. And then I ordered Bulletproof Coffee, and if you want to see that, check out my other channel. I'll put the link in the down bar below. But guys, this product is amazing. But yeah, go check out that video. It'll be up next week. And this is my little helper helping me carry it inside. And I'm just going to show you really, really quickly just kind of what, what comes in the box if you're interested in this. This is not something that you need. You can use other people's MCT, XCT oil, right. and I explain a little bit more about that in my review, but I'm just kind of showing you what it looks like coming out of the box because this ghee looked a thousand times better than the stuff that was in my blog from like 10 days ago, which looked, well, there's not a word for it. It was just a nightmare. I'm gonna try ghee now because that looks more like butter, so. Let's have a, let's have a taste. All right guys, and I know I look disgusting right now, but my children have been sick for like two straight days, so I have had very little sleep. But I have to be honest, this is so, so good. Like it's super creamy and rich and there's no weird separation like there was in that other ghee. All right, and then just two last things I wanted to share with you guys. I created this keto pattern tracker and basically it has all the dates and your weight and calories and macros and everything and it just is very helpful to log it every day number one for accountability and number two it helps you to see patterns weekly patterns monthly patterns so it's just a free document i created anybody is welcome to download it and i will put the link in the description box below and then the last thing that i wanted to share with you guys is that my friends and i started a facebook group for people that are doing keto so if you're interested in joining that group i will put the link in the car in the carbs below? No, in the description box below. Obviously somebody wants carbs today, it's me. Anyways, it's Silence of the Carbs and it's listed down below, so let's wrap this vlog up. Well, that's gonna be a wrap for my one month keto update. I hope you enjoyed that. I do post weekly keto updates, so if you wanna join me, don't forget to leave a like, comment, or subscribe, and turn on that little bell so you receive notifications every time I upload my weekly progress vlogs, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Do me a favor, don't quit on yourselves, just keep going.